Hey, my loves, it's your girl, Miss Smith XX here. Okay, you guys, we're having a night show tonight. Come on in the room, come in the room. Um, I'm so excited about tonight's show. You guys, come on in the room. Come on in the room, you guys. Come on in the room. Um, come on in the room, come on in the room, come on in the room. Come on in the room. I said, oh, I love my, I love my people and I love y'all so much, okay? God, I love y'all. Hey, come on in the room. Let me put this up here right quick so we can know. Oh, thank you, baby. Thank you. My boo bought this for me. Hey y'all, come on in the room. Come on in the room. It's freestyle Friday. I'm just, I'm just um doing some things while having y'all come on in the room. Um, let me tighten and put this right down here, right quick. Hey, come on in. Thank you, sis. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Okay. Let me see. Hold on. Nemo. See. Yes. Y'all give me y'all give me a couple seconds. I'm trying to put this in here. Cause we're trying to take the show to the next level. And I just wanna make sure everybody, anybody wanna help the show, they'll know what where to go. Okay, we t we about to talk about the fuck we're going on in the mix. <laughs> we don't talk about that since I want to talk about all the stuff, but don't get me wrong. We're gonna we gonna talk about that too, okay? Cause <laughs> okay, all right, there we go. All right, how are my loves doing? Y'all doing all right tonight? You having a good time this Friday night? I was I was feeling a little royal, a little purple. Hope y'all like it. Um, I am so excited, you guys, because today makes, um, two weeks that we did, we've been doing the show. I've been doing the show and haven't missed not one day. And I told you guys I was committed to this. No days off. Um, and also I had a call, conference, um, call with somebody about, um, you know, some things that we're trying to do for the show. And I am just so excited that things are happening. And um, I thank you guys. I thank you, my loves, for all your love, all your support. Thank you guys. Come on in the room. Come on in the room. Come on in the room. Um, because um, without you guys' support, because of your likes, your shares, um, catch up for whatever you're doing, you're helping me to keep this on the air. And I thank you, my loves. I thank you. Thank you so much. Okay. All right. Tonight's show is going to be um like Freestyle Friday. So we're just going to have a little fun tonight. We're going to talk a lot. We're going to talk some topics and things of that nature. Okay. So I got, um, I got one short topic I want to start with. Um, but you know what? I may say that, um, anybody, anybody got anything they want to talk about before, before I start? Anybody? Anybody want to start? Y'all just showed me so much lights because of hell. Oh my God. Y'all showed me so much light. Oh, I love y'all. I love y'all. Thank y'all for loving up on me tonight. I love you. I love you guys. I needed that so much. Hey, Sherrod, I see you. I love Sherrod. I remember doing an interview with Sherrod, um, a couple years ago and Sherrod is, um, was what well, is, is one of the sweetest people I ever met. Just a gem. Just, just, just a gem. I love Sherrod. He's just a gem. Um, and, and, and is, is, he's a very, um, person who just, he's just gonna tell like it is. He's gonna get it to you like it is. And I, and I absolutely love him about that. I love him about that. All right, you guys. So, um, <laughs> one thing I want to talk about is the fact that, um, why is it that Twitter suspended Trump's account, then reinstated it, and then now it's been, um, suspended 
right now permanently and definitely. It's like y'all should just let his count um suspended permanently. Just just let it suspended permanently. Go, but it's but it's over. And and then he gonna have the nerve to say, um, Kendra Kendra the comedian. Hold on, do I know who that is? Kendra the comedian, London. Okay, so um, I'm gonna see if this is gonna go live. I'm telling y'all now. Whoever just want to go live with me, I don't mind having guests. But I tell you two things. I two things. I two things about my show. One, if you're not woman enough or man enough to come in the light, I'm gonna kick you off. I'm not talking to no dark. I'm sorry. That's my show. That's the way I do it. Number two, if you're disrespecting any kind of way, you're getting put off. Okay? So can you do that? All right. We're going to see. Friday. So I'm, I'm, I said it was first time Friday. So open the floor to the guests. We're going to see. So I like your purple wig. That's so ugly. So, um, I hope you got your, I hope you got your little, um, 10 seconds of fame. Hope that was good for your baby. I'm glad that I can give you those little 10 seconds of fame to do whatever you want to do. Okay. Wonderful. All right. Anybody else? Matter of fact, we're going to make sure. Bam. Now, now we, got, now we don't have to worry about you anymore. So I hope you got your little 10 seconds because you have been evicted. Like Trump about to. You about to lose your job, okay? Because you just got evicted. Okay. Um, Who else wanted to come up here? Thank you, my loves. She's so happy for me. Thank you, my loves. I'm thanking y'all. I just thank y'all so much for all the love and support you've given me. Um, It is just so, so wonderful. Um, One topic I really want to talk about tonight, this is what I really want to talk about beginning to start off the show is um, a problem that I had. Well, it's a problem that I've experienced a lot of, and that is colorism. It's colorism. Um, a lot of people, <clears throat> um, excuse me, um, haha, he's going. He's going out kicking the screen. Yes, man, he went out kicking the screen. So he got a little, he, he's got, he got his little seven seconds of fame kicking the screen. Um, colorism is definitely something that I experienced. Um, whew, um, I actually, before I tried to start the show, I was trying to um, partner with somebody to do the show and a sponsor. And one of their conditions, one of the conditions of the show was they said that they'll prefer. Um, if I were to bleach my skin or light my skin, because to their object, they were like, well, if you're lighter skin, it will be easier for us to, um, to, to, to work your brand, to promote your brand. And for me, when I heard that, I was like, no, I'm not doing it. I mean, um, yes, it is a harder journey being a brown or dark girl, but for me, I love my chocolates. I love my brown skin. And no matter how many obstacles are, or, or how many people don't like it, it is something about myself that I will never change. I love my melanin. I will, I don't care how high I get. I don't care how much, I don't care how um, I'm able to take care of myself. Um, I love my melanin. I love my skin. I love being a brown skin girl. I love it. So um, that was, and that was very hurtful for me because of the fact that um, these were some very, very well-known people on the internet. They're not very well-known people in Atlanta too. And um, it, it's sad that we have, we have start putting things on a level to where um, is that, you have to be a lighter shade to get to where you are. Um, because, for example, I look at Lizzo. Lizzo gets a lot of flack um, because, you know, from people who hate on her because, you know, her weight or whatnot. But Lizzo also gets a lot of flack because she's brown skin. If she was light skin and heavier, would she still probably get some hate? Yes, she probably would. But I guarantee you the hate would not be um, as a as a light skinned plus size woman, as much as she's getting as a brown skinned dog, because people just people don't realize the 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 hate and um, the disrespect that brown skinned trans women and brown skinned um, black women go through. It's a struggle, and 
Um, I love all my sisters, whether you're light skin, brown skin, dark skin, whatever. But we have to, we, we can't ignore the fact that brown skin and dark skin trans women and brown skin and dark skin black women um, have, have it harder. It's a harder struggle for us, you know? Um, and I don't say that be a pity partner like that, but it is what it is. It's just colorism is still real. And what really pisses me off so much is when guys um, love to say, well, you're mad because somebody got a preference, preference, um, and preference for um, light skin. I don't care about nobody's preference. But the thing about it, stop hiding preference but, um, behind colorism. Because pre because colorism, the thing about it is, if, if, you, if you're dating somebody light skin, you like dating light skin, that's fine. I don't have a problem with that. What I have a problem with is if you're dating someone light skin and then you tend to put down brown skin and dark skin, people say things like, they're not pretty, um, they're ugly, they smell, they're loud and rash, they're fine. Though all those things help, you know, um, all those things play into this narrative um, of, uh, of colorism. And colorism is something wrong. And we, we love to say we, we must address racism. But in order for us to address racism within the black community, we have to address homophobia. We have to address transphobia. And most importantly, we need to address colorism, okay? So all you guys out there who are colorists, get your act together and, 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 just, and just let let the brown and dark skin sisters be. Let them be beautiful and, and, and stop the hate the malice and all that, because it's not called for, okay? That's what irritates me about the media industry. Embrace the melon God. Yeah, they do. They, it, it, it is so harder um, for, for, um, for, for, for brown and dark skin. It's so, so harder. Um, I look at, I'm going to use a case to point, chasing Atlanta. Um, I have nothing against Laura London. No, I mean, excuse me, not Laura London. Ooh, Laura England, England, England for chasing Atlanta. I have nothing against her. Never met her. Don't have nothing bad to say about her Um, because I don't know her. But if you look at the way that show is produced, look at the way they edited and did handle Lauren London scene, a lighter skin trans woman who's transitioning right now versus Kendra, a dark skin trans woman. It's like, it's, it's like they always put her, they always put um, Lauren in scenes to kind of elevate her. As well as with Kendra, they put her in scenes that did not show her in the best light, you know? And it was none to her fault. It's just, to me, the way they, they produced it. And um, I was so glad that one episode where she was able to sit down and talk about the, the Trans Lives Matter, because that was when Kendra was able to show who she was. And I absolutely love T.S. Kendra. I wish her um, all the support. I love T.S. Kendra. T.S. Kendra, um, do your thing. Thank you for representing for the um, dark and brown skin trans women. Thank you for speaking on Trans Lives Matter. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, okay? I'm a brown skin trans. Yes, you are, sis. And you're probably brown skin and beautiful. I can't hardly see the pit because I'm looking down, but I know you're probably beautiful. Have, have you ever experienced colorism? Would you, like to, would you like to come on and talk? You don't have to, but you can if you want to. But, um, yeah, we, ha we have to, as black people, we have to start addressing these things um, like homophobia, like transphobia, like colorism. And colorism is something that, to me, is just, um, it's just so stupid. And what, and what pisses me off so much about colorism, I look at nowadays when people, when people um, are doing movie characters and there's a beautiful brown-skinned girl, people are like, oh, my God, it's a brown-skinned girl. And they're so happy and excited, which I'm happy and excited, too. But I think back to me, it looks like since I was growing up, it almost looked like it's going backwards. Because when I was growing up, it wasn't nothing to see a brown skin, a dark skin girl on, on a TV show or in or a lead in a movie or 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 or, or, or um or on the on the billboard shorts or or in videos. And now it's a struggle to even um get our brown skin and dark skin sisters in that circle. And that is crazy. Because there are so many beautiful sisters out there. And I'm also tired of these men talking about talk, using um, as an excuse why they don't date black women as, oh, I like some exotic, like 50 Cent and, and Lil Wayne was having a little talk about exotic. Dumb. Both of y'all just dumb. Dumb, period. Dumb, period. Just, just dumb. You know, black women. You, how, you, how are you going to tell me a beautiful black 
melanin queen is not exotic. How you gonna fix your mouth to say a beautiful black queen queen is not exotic? No, just 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 say what it is, is that your inner self does not like your dark skin. So you have to choose someone light skin because it's a self-hate on yourself. Just like a couple of years ago when Kodak Black was singing, um, uh, black women too hard. You too hard. And the thing about Kodak Black, he loves to say that. And to all my black women who've ever been disrespected by Kodak, Kodak Black, don't be disrespected. Don't be disrespected. Do not be disrespected, okay? Let, 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 let the other side have him. Let them have him, okay? Let them have him, okay? Hey, oh, I ain't scroll up. I'm missing. Best friend told me for years he doesn't find black women general attractive until I call him on the reason. Call him on the sis. Oh, yeah, that's the way they do. They, they say they never want to say that. Yes, I'm in Atlanta, um, Carrie. Hey, Sky. How you doing, Sky, baby? We doing, we doing a little freestyle show tonight. Um, I love Sky. Sky, you want to come on real quick? Because we do, 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 doing a freestyle thing. If you want to come on, hit me with a request. I'll let you come on. So, but yeah, we yeah, as the black community, we have to, before we can address any of this racial stuff, we got to deal with homophobia stuff. We got to do transphobia stuff. But most importantly, we have to deal with the colorism stuff, okay? We have to deal with it, okay? It, 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 it can't, there's no way that we can get around it, okay? All right? So anybody got any topics? Because I, I, I don't got, I don't got interest in, and I'm not trying to leave no early show tonight. So, anybody got anything? What do y'all think about? Um, so Trump went on Twitter, and Trump was saying, um, he was he was telling he was telling people to who's concerned, um, he will not be at the inauguration. Girl, bye. Girl, bye. We don't want you there. We voted you out. You lost your job. Girl, bye. Bye, please. Bye, please. We don't want you. Hey, Terrence, how are you? We don't want you there. You out. You gone. Bye. <laughs> we don't We don't care. We don't care, Donnie, about you coming. Frankly, we really, it, it's so close to we really just want to preach, preach you in, in any couple of days. But Pence just don't do, won't do it. Because he won't do what needs to be done. But we really do. Like on some real, <laughs> real, <laughs> on the real, you know? Hey, Terrence, how are you? We're just having a freestyle show. Um, Anybody having topics that want to come on the show, just send me a um, request. And we have to come on, okay? Trump is so stupid. Yes, he is so stupid. Cheeto can go ahead and sit down. <laughs> oh, she said Cheeto can go. I can't, I can't say that because I call him Captain Orange. So I can't say that. I can't say that. I, 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 I call him Captain Lawrence, so I can't say nothing. I really can't. I really, really can't, okay? I really, really can't. <laughs> oh, my loves, I love y'all so much. Are y'all staying safe out here? Are you guys staying safe out here? Because I know with um all these mag these delusional Magna supporters um, doing all this crazy stuff with the deep, with, um, um, at the Capitol in California, people just, just, just stupid. Hey Leslie and hey Leslie Joanne. How you doing? We just have the open freestyle show. Um just talking, commenting, and um any anybody who wants to come on um can come on the show. Terrence, um, thank you for um I, I was I was doing something, but I was dipping in and out and I saw um a couple of your virtual prayer on um was it New Year's night, I believe. I think it was New Year's Eve night. New Year's Day, and um, you just have a you you just have a wonderful spirit about you, Terrence. Um, keep that wonderful spirit about you. Just keep that wonderful spirit about you, okay? Please keep that wonderful spirit about you. Just 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 please keep that about you, okay? Because because it's, it's something we need right about now, and you have that, okay? Oh, thank you. I love Leslie, Leslie Joy. I love you. Oh my God! One day, I whenever you're ready, I would love to just have a show um, with you, and I would just love to have a conversation with you, because because but because because um, the way you speak, um, your Instagram and your posts and stuff, I just feel like I just really want to have a conversation with you one day. I just really 
I just would love to have a conversation with you because I know it would be so wonderful. Remember that we are witnessing the end of white supremacy. Yeah, we are witnessing the end of white supremacy. And I'm glad of it. It, it should have been happening. It should have been happening. Yes, ma'am. Thanks so much. I am always praying. Oh, thank you, Terrence. Thank you so much. I've been staying home. I'm going to stay home because I don't want no no one <laughs> vaccine just yet. Oh! <laughs> I'm going to leave that alone. <laughs> she said, I'll stay home because I don't want no vaccine yet. Oh, my goodness. Well, well she say she ain't ready to take the vaccine yet. She ain't ready. Okay, we can make it happen. Definitely, definitely, let's make it happen. I definitely would love to have you on the show. I would love, love to have you on the show because um, I just would love to pick your brain and see what you're doing. Just, 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 just to speak to you because I know it would be um, a wonderful, just wonderful thing. Hold on, I'm checking my message and everything. Whew. How y'all doing? Let me get ready. Oh, you finna get ready to go? Or what you finna do? What you finna do, baby? I'm just, I'm just, I'm just honestly Friday. It's Friday night. I'm just, I'm just talking to my people and um, just doing topics Friday night because I just want to come on and just, I just want to, y'all show me so much love. So I just want to love up on y'all tonight. That's what I want to do. So whatever you want to do. Oh, the gay neighbors in here. Look at the gay neighbors in here. The gay neighbors in here. I see y'all gay neighbor. Baby, they be they're messy, but I <laughs> but I respect y'all though. I respect y'all hustle. I respect y'all grind. The gay neighbor be doing their thing now. The gay neighbor be messy, messy. But but be putting in that work though. And I respect that. If you miss putting, I respect that though. I see you gay neighbors. I see you. Club. <laughs> I've been wearing my mask and face shield. I am not playing with you. I ain't playing with them either. I ain't playing with him either. Because it ain't no joke out there. It ain't, it ain't really no joke. Yeah, hey, thanks for the hearts game there. But I love you, y'all. I know I be checking y'all. I love and I and I'm gonna tell y'all. What got me was that thing with Shamar, where Shamar was like, Y'all messy. Um, y'all, <laughs> I'm just gonna go ahead and block you. And and y'all was so unbothered. I love that. That is y'all. Y'all is a forever mood. Gay neighbors is a forever mood. Y'all is forever mood. Ever mood. Ever mood. I love y'all. All right. So we just having a um freestyle show. Anybody want to do any topics? Anybody want to come on? Um, because we just we, it's it been a messed up day. You know they don't spend the Trump's count um permanently for Twitter. Um, like two people don't resign. Since the riot things, I wear disposable masks under my cloth mask for extra, extra protection. Yes, um, follow it real life reality. Is that it? Real real life reality. Let me see. Let me see who that is. Let me see. All a real life girl. Who you got me following? Let me see now. Cause girl, I hope you ain't got me following nobody. Okay, Terrence followed them, so I that I, I can give it to Terrence. If, if Terrence follow him, I probably gonna give him give him the um I give him the benefit of the doubt to follow. Baby, I love y'all. I also love y'all. Um, have you heard anything more on the black gay man that was stabbed recently? What black gay man stabbed recently? How did this get over my head? I ain't hear about this. I did not hear about this. Gay black man style. Let me look at it right quick. Sis, you gave you giving me some tea. I didn't hear that. So this happened on twenty eighth. Oh Lord, and he's a cute little somebody too. A gay black man in Boston, Massachusetts, was stabbed and left in a coma for four days. Is living in fear, knowing his tech is out there. Why? Oh Lord, it said two two males and a female approached me. Oh, and tapped. Attacked me and stabbed me in my neck and in my stomach. Pretty much ran. Oh my God! This see, this is the homophobia and crap. I, crap! I talk about. We gotta stop. This is what gotta stop. You. That's why I say you gotta be careful out there. You. You gotta be careful about that. I did not hear about that. Thank you, my love, for telling me about that because I did not even hear about that. Thank you for telling me about that. But see, that's that's the reason why we have to be careful out here because it is it is crazy out here. People are crazy. 
people are acting crazy, people are cutting up each, each and every kind of way. Um, it, it, is, it is crazy out here. It is straight up and down um, crazy out here. It's crazy out here, okay? It is straight up and down crazy out here, okay? Um, yes, and they are trying to say it wasn't hate crime. How the hell they want to create hate crime? How the hell it wasn't not a, it was a hate crime? I don't I don't know I don't know if just from what I read, let me go back to it real quick. But just from what I read, crime, I dress he see say because you know I dress very feminine as I spoke. Yeah, it was hate crime. I'm 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 gonna read up on it later, but I guarantee I get I I I I seen enough of these situations and have friends experience enough. It was a hate crime. I'm gonna read up on some more of it later. Um this is also you better be careful because another thing that's happening is that DL Foxness is coming. Yeah, yeah, it is. It is. Thank you, Leslie Drop saying it. Um, that's why I tell all my film boys, um, watch the trades you go with. These trades is robbing and killing and stabbing the boys. To my trans girl, watch the trade. They are they, they are robbing and killing the trans girl. Be careful out there. It is no joke. Be careful. It is no joke out there. Please be careful. Um, we're just having a freestyle um Topic, um, I love, but we were just talking about um, one of my one of the followers told me about um, a, a gay black man is twenty five who was actually stabbed by two men and I believe a female, and he believes it's a hate crime. And I just tell everybody we have to be careful out here because they are. It's, it's a lot of gay men right now. There's um, especially feminine men that's getting attacked and getting stabbed and getting robbed just because they're gay. It's a lot of trans girls who are here who are being stabbed and murdered um, just because um, they're trans or. Or um, because of the fact that the um, guy they're dating is not man enough to stand up and say, hey, this is who I'm dating, and they end up robbing, stabbing, or possibly even kill him. That's why I tell people you got to be safe. You got to carry, or if you got to um, get you some mace, I tell you, have something on you, okay? Hey, yes, it is a hate crime. I live in Philly, and I don't even go out um, as myself because they are, they are on the hunt. Oh, now, baby, I'm going out myself. I'm sorry. I, I'm not going to let nobody stop me from being myself. Now, what I will do is I will be observant. I will um, be safe. I will protect myself. I will watch certain places I go and time day and how I go. But being myself, babe, ain't nobody going to stop me from being myself. No, ma'am. 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 Um, I live in Philly and I don't even go out as myself because they're on the hunt. Oh my Jesus. This is so sad. I will be purchasing me some protection because it's crazy. Yes, it is, Terrence. It it is it is it is very it is very, 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 very crazy out here. It is very, very crazy out here. And, and, and you have to you have to make sure um that you protect yourself because it is it's getting so it's getting so so crazy out here. You have to you have to make sure you protect yourself. Ooh, I had to get hair in my mouth right quick. Looking cute, but getting the hair in my mouth. Yep. What are we doing? Um, I care, Mace, but I'd rather not be out here with these crazy. Yeah, if you if if you if you just don't have to, I tell anybody, if you just don't have to, you don't. But if you have to, um, don't stop letting you letting you live your life. Just um be careful who you are. Who is this? Um you are Okay, you um U Y A R S H I T. I'm telling you right now. Um, if you want to come on, I don't talk to black screens, and I also don't deal with the foolishness. So I tell you what, I'm gonna start doing a test so people don't come in foolishness. Y A R S H I T. Um, name at least three LGBTQ activists. If you can't name three, I'm not letting you come on. Name three. That's the new rule. Name three. You pie. You can't name none, can you? Okay, you can't name none. Okay, good. You're going to be coming on. Okay, so. Oh, thank you, pretty girl rock, for the purple hearts. Thank you for the purple hearts. Some of y'all drop some purple hearts down there if you like my hair. Drop some purple hearts down there. Thank you. Always. Miss Williams, hello. How are you? How are you, girl? Nikki T42, hello. Hello, darling. Hello. How are you? Hello. Hello, how are you? 
So we just had a conversation today and just talking and um, just talking about um, current events in society and everything that's going on. Hey, how are you? Okay, Y-A-R, if you still want to come on, name one LGBTQ activist. Can you name one? Maybe I'll sue harsh for three. I'm going to give you one. Name one. Name one. You name one, I'll let you come on. Name one, I'll let you come on. You can't name one. Yeah, you about that cloud chase stuff. I ain't about that. I tell anybody. I'm I'm <laughs> I'm not with that. I tell anybody if you come on my page, I'm not talking to no black screen. I am not talking to a black screen. And if you get disrespectful within two seconds, I'm not gonna talk or argue with you. I'm just hit that button, boom, you're back. I ain't got time for it. Thank y'all for the black heart. Hey, transgender awareness page. How are you, love? We just have that little um topic discussion and just um talking about things going on events and we're just um just having a fun tonight, you know. I'm here, boo. Yeah, oh you are I know you here because you always here to support me. We're just having a fun tonight. That's all we're doing. Um talking a couple topics and things of that nature. Um yes, oh my goodness. How you doing? Name one of what? Um, okay, so you are some somebody was telling me they want to come on, and a lot of people just come on my live just to hate and cop chase. And I told him to name one LGBT. Well, I first told him to name three LGBT plus activists. He can name none. So then I told him to name one, but he can name one. So I guess he's gone now. So it don't matter. That just showed me he was cloud chaser. Because I I don't do the um I don't do the cloud chaser thing, so. Let's talk about all the, all of all the trials and tribulations trans people go have to go through. Just like with legal discrimination, legal excuse me, legal documentation, it should be hard that hard. To, yeah, um, it it is um, people don't realize the struggles that trans people go through just from um, getting stuff like legal name change, um, um trying to gain employment and their employers um their employers not being willing enough to um accept them accept their um gender identity um also um the fact of sometimes housing um places discriminate against transgender people um when it sometimes um when it comes to adoption um sometimes trans people um are Discriminate against also gay people are discriminated against um when it comes to adoption. Um also trans uh, what people don't realize is for me, I'm hoping that when Biden comes into office, he, he says he's planning on um passing um equality actors to to help LGBT plus people um the first hundred days. And there should be things to help with um more affordable um hormone um for um trans um men most um trans men and trans women um and, and and make it more affordable because it, it is not cheap it is not cheap and it's and it's not easy to get and um those those things should be easier for a person to be able to get in order for them to live their life um you know so those are such just some of the difficulties that affect um yes marsha okay pretty girl girl rock you trying to come on piggybacking what trend in the awareness Page said we need to address trend in the health. I heard a horror story for yes. Um, that's well, that's another thing because a lot because that's one thing that Donald Trump was actually trying to pass. He was trying to when he was office, he was trying to get it passed to where if a transgender person, a gay person, came into the hospital and a doctor said they didn't want to operate them and they died, they could say, "Oh, it's my religious belief," and they could get away with that. But when you're a doctor, you took a Hippocratic oath to save a life. So it doesn't matter whether that person is gay, bisexual, transgender. You took a you took a Hippocratic oath. Do your job as a doctor. You know, I haven't even officially come out as trans at my job, but my boss gives me so much hell about my hair, nails, etc. But said none to the to the to the um, bio girls about anything. Of course he's not. He's probably home. Two two things. One, he's homophobic, transphobic, or two, he might have a crush on you like like that. He probably like transgender. He probably like you, sis. That's probably why he's mad about it. You probably like it. 
Oh my girl, Jan Jeanette. I love my sister. Sis, do you want to come on? Because I love you. Do you want to come on? Because I love you. If you if you want to. We need to make um this an issue for medical school school children. Yes, yes, we need to make it a medical ish. Um, these things need to be addressed, especially um dealing with hospitals and transgender um health care. And just but 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 simply not only that, um health care for all LGBT plus people, but especially transgender people, um, because of the trials and tribulations that trans men and trans women go through. Okay. Thank y'all for everybody coming through. Hey Janelle. I love me some Janelle. I love me some Janelle. Oh. I love me some Janelle. She know I love me. Right. That's insane. Just like they have a um fucking panic act. Uh, panic to fix basically saying they can kill a trans person in several states of the United States and get away with it. Yeah, that's crazy. That's crazy that you can say, oh, I, you know, you can panic, have a panic fix and, and get away with murder. That is crazy. That 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 is just so so crazy, girl. I'm not camera. Okay, sis, I got you. I got you. I I I I ain't, I, ain't, I ain't, if you're not camera ready, sis, I ain't gonna let you do. It. But I but I just want to let you know that I see you and I love you, my sister. So that and just for you coming in the room and showing me love, it means so much. Okay, you don't have to. I'm not like I understand. Uh, but thank you for just 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 coming in the room, showing me love. Love what you're doing. Oh, uh, thank you, sis. That means so much. I see what you're doing too, because you're making some moves. And um, keep doing you. Um, and just don't let anybody stop you and keep pushing, my sister. Just keep pushing. Keep pushing. Keep on pushing. Keep on pushing. We we all have to um, we all have to push because we all have separate platforms and we all have um a voice. And um, I want to use my voice to, uh, to 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 keep pushing and pushing rights. And I want you to keep using your voice, the wonderful voice that you have, to keep pushing for rights, okay? I love y'all. Y'all show me so much love tonight. I love y'all. Y'all just show me some love tonight. I just came on night to really just show y'all some love and just... But yeah, transgender people really receive... Um, it, um, by, it's so much LGBT, LGBTQ plus um, actually need to be passed the 101st day as soon as um, Biden Harris get in office. You're welcome so much. Anytime, anytime, sis, anytime, anytime, anytime. Anybody got any more questions? Anybody got any more questions? Okay. Because if not, don't make me leave now because y'all know I'm going to go, go, to, go to my other party, go get on TikTok. How was everybody? Yeah, how was everybody's day? Was everybody, was everybody's day all right? Everybody good? Y'all wonderful? Are y'all staying safe? If if you going outside, please wear your mask. Um, please try to social distance as much as you can. Um, keep people's hand sanitizer on you. Um, you know because this we gotta flatten this curve. You know it's it's coming up on a year. This thing has been out and we still don't have it under control. But granted, we granted we had a um idiotic president who do away the playbook that Barack Obama um left for him in case this happened because he was an e egotistical, excuse my language, asshole. You know, period. So that's the way it was. That's the way it was. That's the way it is. Period. Okay? TikTok the same so I can give you a follow. Yes, TikTok is the same. Um, Give me a follow. I'll give you a follow back, okay? When I go up there, I'll give you a follow back. I promise you. My day was good. Was your day good, Terrence? Was your day good? Was your day good? I'm glad. I'm gonna hope you. I hope your day was real good. I hope all my loves had a wonderful day. Um, I had a wonderful day. What about dealing with family as a trans person? Um, this is what I say about dealing with people. With people dealing with family as a trans person. Um, state how you feel, but understand that. Okay, how to put this? Stay how you feel and and voice your opinion and don't don't back down from speaking your truth and who you are. But also understand the result you get may not be the one you want at that particular time, or it may not possibly ever be the time. But understand this um, is that sometimes the best family is not always the ones you are born into, but it's the one you get to choose. Okay. All right. 
that's sometimes some of the best families, okay? Sometimes some of the best, okay? We are all, I hope everybody doing good tonight. I love all y'all. Y'all be making my day, though, okay? Y'all be really, really making my day, okay? Y'all really, really making my day. I'm going to get trans. Um, She's going to come on here one day live with me one day. I'm going to get her come on here live with me one day. So she about to be ready one of these days. She gonna, I'm going to send that request. You're going to come on. You're going to come on one of these days. Really. I'm going to get you. I'm going to get you out of that shell. You're going to come on. Hey, love. Hey, baby, hey, BBW. How are you? BBW queen. We're just having a free freestyle night, and I'm just talking and talking topics and just showing some love. We're just loving each other back. Just just because right now, it's just, it's just been a crazy last couple of days. Oh, uh, I can... I can come now. I'm in my bundle. I mean, that's the, I don't, I don't, I don't, I tell anybody this. I don't push nobody. Um, it's, 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 it's on you. If you don't want to come, I respect that. If you do, I respect that. So that's on you. Okay. But understand this, you, you and you in my house and anybody who showed me love is welcome in my house. Okay. Yeah. If, if you feel comfortable waiting, you just wait. You fine. I'm good. Uh, I'm good. Thanks. Good. See you. Oh, Thank you, BBW um, Queen. I love you too, man. I love you too, my sister. I love all of y'all who are just showing me love and just y'all are just so wonderful. And, and I'm so thankful and grateful for having you guys in my life. I love and adore each and every one of you. Y'all just really, really don't know. I love and adore each and every one of you, okay? I love you guys. Y'all just don't know. But by my heart, I love you. Oh, thank you, sis. Thank you, sis. I'm glad you love it. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Anybody got any questions? If you got some questions, um, drop them down the question box. So you can drop them right here and we will answer them. Ooh. Oh, I'm just feeling good. Anybody else just feeling good? Just happy to be alive? Let's talk about the way society treats trans people in person. Okay, we can talk about that. Um, society. Now, here's the thing about society and the way it treats trans people in person. Um, one thing that um my sister Hope Giselle said um a while back, who I I absolutely love that sister. I am such a fan of hers. I love me some Hope Giselle. I love me some Hope disguise. Hope Giselle. I love I absolutely love her. Um, trans getting in that box, son. Okay. Um, is the fact that We need to we need to realize my black gay men need to understand that their that their trans sisters are their sisters, and there needs to stop being so much division because I see so many trans men excuse me excuse me so many gay black men um, who will let their trans who will see their trans sisters in the streets being hurt and will let it happen. My black gay men, those are your sisters, and also we need to pass this thing to hope hope back to hope Giselle. She was talking all the time. We need to learn to protect all trans women, not just the ones that you deem passable. Because it's like I'm noticing a, a trans society to where if they trans, like people only want to pay respect to transgender women who they deem passable, who they consider attractive. It's like if they don't consider you attractive, if they don't consider you passable, they don't want to, they don't want to acknowledge your existence. They don't want to, um, they, they, they basically don't want to um, back you or anything like that. And, and that's something that we need to really, that's something that a lot of um, trans allies, LGBT plus allies, and a lot of sister to black men need to really address within themselves. Really. We need to really, really address that. Because every trans woman deserves respect. I don't care whether she's passable or not. I don't care whether she's 6'1", 5'3". I don't care whether she's light-skinned, brown-skinned. Every trans woman deserves respect, period. Every trans woman deserves respect, period. Period. And ain't, ain't no doubt. If they're a trans woman, they deserve respect because they are a trans woman. They are a woman, period. So get so respect them and give them respect, okay? Respect them and give them respect. Hey, y'all. Ooh, it be this one little piece. Y'all let me do it, y'all. Have a good good wig on, and it just be like one little baby hair, some just one little hair from the wig, just one keep slanging in your mouth. 
I'm just kidding. I love y'all. Okay. How do you guys get treated in public? Um, I mean, for me, I don't really care how I get treated in public. I don't care. Um, I think sometimes maybe people are intimidated me because I am a slim girl, but I am a tall girl. And I think I think that sometimes intimidate them. Um, so I don't really. And plus, if someone says I don't really care, I'm just long. My biggest thing is 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 if you put your hands on me. That's when I'm. That's when I'm like, okay, hey, hey, hold up, you're, you're, sir, you're you're invading my space. You're invading my space. You know that 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 since that's when you gotta drop that voice. You, sir, you're invading my space. You're you're invading my space. Yes, excuse me. Yes, you're invading my. Yes, thank you, thank you. Okay, thank you. I love everyone, and I don't and I don't put a category on no one. I love you. That's the best way to be. Why and, and why shouldn't we all be like the BB Queen? Um, be the BBW queen because we are all people and why can't we just love each other? We should just love each other, period. I know that's right. I love BBW queen. BBW queen, you want to come on? If you don't, you don't have to if you don't want to. Trail the Reapers. Trail the Reaper, did you come on last time and I blocked you? Or I cut you off or some because I think he was playing on my live and I really didn't have time for that. Ah, oh, <laughs> she said trail trade ass back. <laughs> oh, now you the agnostic that call of trade. <laughs> yes, I've had to come um at my co-workers for disrespecting a trans girl at work. These men, especially our black men, need to understand that we are fighting the same fight. Equality. Yeah, that's right. He says he said he 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 did come back on my page again, sis. He 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 do, he do keep coming alive though. I don't I don't, I'm let that go, but he do keep coming alive, sis. He do keep coming alive. That's the last time I keep him. He still coming up alive. I won't show my face. Um, that's fine. Um, I, it um how can I put this? I I don't like talking to blank screens. I don't. I don't know why. Like I see some people on Instagram. They be talking to like people in the dark and stuff like that. And I be saying to myself, I can't do that. Like for me, if I talk to you, I gotta see face to face. So we can just talk your BBW queen. I understand. So real life reality, I just I just followed you because um somebody told me to follow you that it was on me. So I, I hope I hope that you are either a member of the community or at least an advocate or an ally. I'm hoping. I'm really hoping so. I'm hoping so. That's what I'm really hoping. <laughs> Trey said, I hate when black people say we choose to be in the fight in the LGBT plus community, but they they don't choose to be black. So not black. Who would choose the fight that the LGBT that gay people have? Who would choose the fight that bisexual people have? Who would choose to fight fight the pansexual people have? Who would choose to fight the non-binary people? Have? Who would choose to fight the black trans women? Who would choose that fight, sis? Who would choose? Who would choose that fight? Who would? Nobody. None of us would choose. Nobody would choose that fight. Please. Yeah, Leslie, let's join. I'm with you on that. It just, it just something about. I just, it just, I, I can't do it. I just, there's no disrespect, but I tell anybody, if you gotta come in the black screen, don't do it. Just talk me on him, cause it just, I, I, I need, I need, I just need to see you, cause, cause I, I, I need, I need to see you. Cause, cause as you know, as Leslie and Jordan, as Leslie and Jordan, Alan knows, it's just something about when you see somebody, you can read them a little too, and you can figure stuff out too. She know that why. I know she's a very smart, educated person, so I know she know that's why. But um, oh yeah, I hate too because I mean they don't know, they don't, they don't. It's let's say something when it comes to history, I tell anybody. This is the reason why I'm glad Bessie DeVos, Bessie DeVos has been fired. Well, not fired. She, she was going to get fired when body coming off, so she went on resign before. But there needs to be more real black education because we have black history month, but African, black history is not taught in schools the way it should be. We need to talk more black history, real black history. We need to talk more um, Hispanic and Latino history. We need to, we need to teach um, more um, Native American history in school. All these are things that um, need to be taught more in school, okay? They say we choose to be in the LGBT community, but they don't choose to be black. So there's going to be nothing. That is one of the stupidest things. They love, they love, they love to use that weak, 
ASS argument. And that's what it is. It's a weak ASS argument. Period. It's, it's, it, when people say that, I just, I just look at them like, really? Really? Is that all you have? Is that all you have? Is really is that all you have? Because that's, that's just weak. That is, that's, just, that's, just, that's, that's really, really weak. Really, really weak. Okay? Anybody else got any more questions? While we, oh, because we have, we're just having a fun little Friday night. I hope everybody's here. And we're just having a fun little Friday night. I guess Trey don't left because I guess Trey left. <laughs> I mean, Trey. Guess he left. Okay. There, there was no civil rights without black LGBT plus people. Spelman College is starting a queer study. Thank, yes. Um, of course. People, yes. And people don't realize that um, LGBT plus people were at the front of so many um, of black history from Byron Rushton to Angela Davis to Marsha P. Johnson. And these are the people that they don't want to talk about. And I'm so glad that Spelman is having a queer studies program. I would love to find out more about that. Yes. Yes. I would love, I would love to take a lecture class for you, Les, 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 Leslie Joy Allen. I would love to take a lecture. I would love that. I would love that so much. Tell them, sis. And Trey be stalking Trey to so that ain't they though? Won't I'll be so annoying? Wanna call your name, say you ain't this and that, say you ugly this and that. But be the main ones being your DM. Be the main ones when I be coming out of the stone. Hey, 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 Sean, come in. No. No, no. Besides, I, 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 I got an entanglement. I can't deal with. It. I can't do. It. I got an entanglement right now. Um, but no, Trey just, Trey just, they do. They be since Trey just, Trey do be irritating a lot of times. Trey be irritating a lot. They really be irritating a lot of times. Really be irritating a lot. They really, really be irritating a lot. A lot they be irritating. Okay. A lot. They really, really just be irritating the mess. Like it'd be like, come on. Like, can you can you just uh like uh like uh all right y'all. If not I told y'all now, I gotta go over and show my gay babies on TikTok some love now. So if y'all run out of questions stuff, I'm gonna have to in a live and we're gonna go, I'm gonna go over TikTok. I gotta show them love, cause, cause if if y'all ain't find me, I gotta say this. I love my IG and YouTube family, cause y'all show me love. But baby, they be showing me some love on TikTok. They be really showing me some love on TikTok. Y'all show me love too, but they be really showing me some love. But I thank y'all so much, cause I'm sorry that I was late coming on today, but um, I was trying to um had a had a meeting and just trying to get some things to better make the show, because um, it is hard when you're trying to do everything to kind of create a lane of your own. Um, by yourself without any help and then being a black trans woman makes it even harder. Um, so it's a lot that I'm trying to accomplish and you know, it's, it's, it's but, but, th but, but I'm going to work it, through God and through faith and through hard work it's going to happen, okay? And I've noticed that some trade use being down low or DL as a pass like they think it's a pass or we have um, to mess with them because they, don't, they are down low. Yeah, but see a lot of trade think that um, trans women have to mess with them because of the fact they are um, they they they, they want to make trans women feel like that nobody else will want them. That's what they want. Okay, um, pretty girl rock. What's it? What's um, is it, my 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 TikTok name is the same as here. My TikTok, my YouTube, my Twitter, all this is is Miss Nelly XO. So everything the same. I kept everything the same. Um, let's see, BBW Queen. Let's see what she got going on. Let's see. Ah, let's see. Let's see. Hello, 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 hello. Okay. So we waiting for um a we wait for a BBW Queen mystery. Um, I think it's when I guess it's connecting. Mm, I don't know. I don't know. Okay. Well, she may not want to come on. I, I, I thought I had saw the request for her to come on, but okay, if not, we'll keep going on, okay? Yeah, pretty girl, girl, um, Brock, um, it's, it's Miss Melly XX. Hello, Emma, how are you? We're just having a little fun tonight. 
just talking, conversating, showing a little love and just doing us. Okay? Everybody doing all right? Okay, let's enjoy. DL needs someone to look down on because they are not shit themselves since they're mistreating the trainer. Period. Uh, Miss, uh, Leslie, Leslie Joy Allen, every, all of that. All of that. All, it's, it's, it's all of that for me. It's all of that for me. It's all of that for me. <laughs> Good night, sis. I'm tired. I've been busy. Yeah, go go get some rest, baby. BBW Queen says, I don't know what happened. Period, Leslie. I, I don't I don't know what happened either. I tr hold on, I'll try it again, sis. Hold on. Let's try it one more time. I'll try it one more time. I'm gonna see if we connect this time. But yeah, it's um it's it's all Leslie Leslie Joy Allen. Alan, it's it's all that for me. It's all of that for me. All of that for me, okay? Okay, I don't I don't know. I don't know what's going on with it. it's not doing it. I don't know. Well, that's fine though. Um, but I thank y'all guys so much for showing me love. Um, like I was telling you guys, I was um I'm trying to get things done for the show and it's hard um doing it by myself and trying to create my own lane and especially as a um dark skinned black trans woman. But I'm I'm pushing forward, I'm gonna get it done and um I just I just I'm gonna get it done, okay? I want to say everybody be good. Have a good night. Um, I absolutely love and adore all you guys. I love you guys. Have a good night, okay? Bye.